In this video we'll create a simple scenario using the record macro functionality. By default, in the recorded script, it will be put one second delay between each command. We can switch between other kinds of timing while recording. So, all commands performed are now stored in the script. In this example we'll make each light blink in turn. To end the recording session we click the Save button. The resulting script is then shown in the Program Editor page. Here we can change the name, the description, choose a category for it. We can also review all recorded commands, capture new commands, manually add new ones. Edit, arrange or delete commands. Once done editing, we save the script and activate it from the programs list. This way the script can be added to a group just like a standard module. After adding the script to a group, it will be shown as a button with a status light. When the script is running the light will be green. If the script is idle, it will be yellow. A script can also automatically run when certain conditions occurs. In this example we'll make the script run if the door is opened. So we open the script in the program editor and we edit the trigger code. We can choose between various type of triggering. Capture the condition, or add it manually. In this case the condition is that the door sensor value must be greater than zero, so, when the door is open. We save the script once again and let's now test if everything is working. Everything is working as expected. So, enjoy your home genie and do not forget to donate if you find this product useful.